The British government has confirmed Queen Elizabeth will host Donald Trump on his upcoming state visit despite an anti-Trump petition with over 1.5 million signatures. For insight, we're joined by Ida Smythe Bishop and her daughter, Edith. Donald Trump has no business in Great Britain. He does too. He's a good at golf course in Scotland. Yes, and that's why golf pencils are so small, because of his tiny hands. <laughs> so I take it you're against Trump's visit? Wouldn't mind him visiting me. Why ever for? His hair looks like a veil of straw come undone. Precisely. I want to nibble on it for my supper. Heavens, girl, for the hundredth time, he shan't be leaving Melania for you. Why shan't he? Melania always looks like she smelled something but can't remember it. But she's a model, darling. So aren't I. I was on the cover of a bridal magazine. Ah, uh, yes, B-R-I-D-L-E. <laughs> As in Equestrian Weekly. That saddle was quite becoming on you, Edith, darling. Did you sign the petition to stop President Trump from visiting? Ah, a petition won't keep him away. Nothing will, unless we add a stand to the end of England or turn off the porch lights at Buckingham Palace like a poor family on Halloween. I mean, the man is mentally unstable. I'd like him to visit my stable. So are you a horse, or do you want to be a horse? Or... Look, never mind. Let's just say the public is divided over Trump's visit. Indeed. So why not hold a referendum? Should Donald Trump be banned from England, I vote yay! And I vote nay! <laughs> uh, good night. Catch all the latest from this season of 22 Minutes. Subscribe to CBC Comedy now and watch 